Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a little review for you guys on this product right here. This is the Texture ID Styling Cream. If you guys don't know, Sally recently launched this line and it is, from my experience so far, is an okay product. Now, it, what it says is, is is a styling cream of course and it helps uh, provide medium hole by retaining moisture and elasticity. So the reason why I didn't do a first impression on this product is because I actually wanted to give it a run and see how it is when I do a style and I redo the style and I keep applying the product, see if there's any build up, any flakage and stuff like that and that's exactly what I did. So first, this product is $8.99 and oh, there's some hair in there. But it's okay. So this is how much I use after applying the cream two times to my head. And they also have a shampoo, a conditioner, a deep conditioner from this line. I do have the deep conditioner, but that is going to be in a uh, deep condition with me. So just stay tuned for my uh, filling on that. But yeah, so the consistency of this is really lightweight. It feels lightweight, so it's not like super thick, and it's really creamy, and it like absorbs into the hair really well, for me anyway. The smell is really fresh. It smells like, not a cleaning product, but it smells fresh. I don't know, like, you know, it's not floral, it's not sweet, it's like fresh, clean and fresh. So... This has coconut butter and shea butter in it. Um, it is, it says it's I, ideal for curls that need extra control and conditioning. This ultra rich whipped cream is enhanced with coconut oil, cocoa butter, shea butter, and wheat protein to provide curl definition and fridge protection. Great for twist out, rises, and protective styles. Now, what made me want to get this was a YouTuber I seen. Um, using this and she used this for her uh, one product wash and go so I was like I really want a product that I can do a wash and go with but I don't have to use a gel on top so I want to try this unfortunately a wash and go did not work for me I found myself using a lot of product and I wasn't getting a lot of definition I got some definition which is good this cream actually does give you definition but for my hair it wasn't um it wasn't getting rid of the frizz for me in a wash and go, so that's why I just turned it into a twist out. So I did a twist out with this cream, and this is not the results, but this is about fifth day here. And um, so I applied it the first day, did my twist out, let it dry overnight, and I had bomb results. Like my results was so good, but then it rained. So the rain and the humidity it really messed up my hair and so that night I retwisted my hair and I put six twists into my hair and um, then I wore it out for a day and then this is the second day from the second twist up so there is some um, curl definition um, it is pretty frizzy because it is hot today and it's just it is what it is but um, I did some little flat twists in the front to kind of give my style some cuteness because my front of the hair was really really frizzy and my front is always frizzy so it's, that's just how it is but um, the second day definition it was good but again humidity and stuff like that it really just turned my hair into a poof ball like you see. Now. Let's get into some pros. The pros of this product is it's $8.99. It's cheap. It's affordable. I like it. The smell isn't bad. It has great ingredients in it. Um, some of the great ingredients are sunflower seed oil, coconut oil. Like the first, let's say, 10 to 15 ingredients I can actually read which is really good and then it gets into some stuff I can't pronounce but that's okay so it's really it's really a moisturizing product I felt that like on my hair even still I have a lot of oil and I didn't use anything else when I did this style I just used the cream I didn't use 
a water I didn't use an oil I just used this just so I can see how it is on its own and for me I feel like I would probably put a gel on top just so that it will help with frizz but it's really not bad um so my hair is still really moisturized and like I said I applied it twice now there's a downfall because this product flaked and it's still flaking it's flaking a lot and I'm just like embarrassed to wear black clothes because that's how much it's flaking on me um yeah I wear like black a lot this is black and there was flakes on it um, I wear a black jacket and stuff like that and it's just flakes all over it and this is the only product I use this is the only product I reapply so it seems like you have to be light handed or it will flake like it did for me um, I guess it also depends on your hair, but I didn't add no gel, I didn't add no edge control, I didn't add nothing that would not go with this for it to flake. So it's just on its own. I guess use it sparingly, use it light handedly, and that's pretty much it. But I did like this product. Again, it didn't work for a wash and go for me because I had to use too much. It did give me curl definition, but um, it's not really lasting. And so to hold. I would say for me the hold is not medium it's like soft it's like a real soft hold because if I um you know go in a shower or lay on it just a little bit it will just poof up so right now there is some curl definition and this is the second day after I retwisted it for the second time but all in all I would definitely buy this product again I know how to use it for next time. Also, it is for my hair type. It says for type 3 and 4 hair. So, I really do like that. I really like the price. I can't wait to see what the deep conditioner do. So, stay tuned for that. And, yeah, tell me down below if you guys used this before. If you plan on using it. What are your thoughts? And just let me know down below. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.